Here is a quick video to show how to support students through submitting a Dropbox assignment. That's what it's called, Momentum. You will see them as anything listed with MCPS in the title or with this little logo here, the Dropbox logo. We're going to use this virtual watershed study. Now, when you come across this or when a student comes across this using their Google Chrome login, right? they can have their Kami extensions complete any PDF. Right? They have to download the PDF. That's the main piece. Uh, most are going to be on a Chromebook, uh, PC. Max can do this just fine as well, as long as the student doesn't try to submit it in pages. Anyways, when you click that, you obviously get this download here. In this case, the student pulls this up. They can download it, they can save it, they can print it to a PDF. Multiple options here, right? Next step, student will bring up Kami, again, using their Chrome extension. They will then drag over their downloaded file from Adventum. They can then use Kami to edit, draw, do whatever they need to do. They can still access the documents and links within the PDF. Once they have completed their document, they will download it again. Yes, I know, it's downloading and downloading. They complain about their space link, tell them to get a better storage plan, no. Uh, yes, download with all annotations. Make sure, let them know how you want them to, maybe file name it, you can do it with their last name, you can do it with their name, your name, however it works for your grading purposes. Once they've downloaded that, let's go check out how they submit it. Now this side of Edmentum you won't see. This is what the students see when they're submitting uh, this MCPS Virtual Watershed Study. When they click play on this, they will get a similar look to what we saw in the teacher view with the download. They can click either one here. And the key difference being the file center. What needs to happen is they need to select upload new file. They will choose their watershed study that we just named and downloaded from Kami with all those annotations. And they will upload that file. And then finally, once we've uploaded that file, we have the seemingly simplest part, but sometimes the trickiest part. Click this checkbox. Make sure you instruct your students to do this. And then submit selected file. If they have multiple files, they can do that. But they must click that box. Submit select file. Submit for scoring. They can pop a nice note to you. You are the and they submit, and they will get this here. If you have troubles with students submitting work, make sure they follow these instructions and they click that checkbox to submit their files. Good luck submitting Dropbox assignments.